Hey guys, it's Woody's twin brother, Steve. I've got something special for you tonight. Woody has asked me to review one of his oldest videos, so I'm gonna do that now. Uh, it's an older video that's not getting a lot of views, and he asked me to watch it and give my opinion on it. So he wants to figure out you know, why it's not performing well. You guys aren't clicking on it and watching it. So we're gonna look at it together. You can like, subscribe, and comment below what you think of the video. And if you like this, maybe we can do some more of these in the future where I can review his videos. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna treat it like movie night. We're gonna have some snacks. Uh, the, the Filipino neighbor brought Woody some snacks and uh, then she told me like, shh, and then winked at me. And I was like, excuse me, little Filipina, don't shish me, okay? You better go sit down somewhere. But anyway, she said these are for Woody, but he's at work, so I'm gonna eat them. Okay, so we got some uh, Nova multigrain snacks, country cheddar. Uh, we got some, uh, what is this? Oh, some Ishi Oshi Oishi. I don't know how to say that. It's prawn crackers. We're gonna do that. And then she's brought some kind of cupcake over here. Um, cheesy cupcake in Saimada. She says it's cupcake with cheese on it. I'm like, gross. Okay, but I'll try it. And then, um, some pandesal ubi cheese pandesal. I think it's, it looks like rotten potatoes to me. So we'll try that out. But anyway, it's movie night. We're going to review his crappiest video so let's get to that right now okay so here we go let's take a look while they're making them of course these are stuffed with cheese i like to stuff mine with a little bit of meat i don't know if they have any that are stuffed with meat okay first of all you're so mukbanging frozen mexican food so that's half your problem right there goya brand chili rellenos mexican style stuffed peppers Oh, God. Yes, authentic roasted poblano chili stuffed with delicious cheese drizzled with a mild tomato sauce. We can Google Authentic that. Chilies, poblanos, rellenos con delicioso queso y una suave salsa de tomate. Boy, is teaching me how to speak Spanish. Well, you're Excellent not very good at it. Vitamin C per serving. Excellent day, Fuente day. Oh my God, can we stop with the fake Spanish? Gourd, gourd. Good source of protein and vitamin A. I need my protein. Buena so. Fuente day, protein. Oh my God, stop it. Sauce included. Salsa incluida. Oh my God. Yeah. There they are. Goya brand. Chili Rellenos. Okay, so that's what it looks like on the box. And this is a, Gross. what you see and what you actually get. Ugh. And I have to say, it looks pretty damn good. Oh, now, good course, heavens. I a little sour cream on top. I'm sure you I did. I like cilantro, too, with my Chili Rellenos. Gross. But I um, don't have any, so... And I splattered the salsa all around the plate. I tried to make it look like a five-star restaurant. Oh, my God. That's how we do it. What kind of five-star restaurants are you going to? I'm trying to be fancy. You're not. You're not Tell fancy you at all. Let's see what we got here, man. This, this, I'm excited about this. My chili rellenos, I used, I used to uh, batter them like this in egg batter. It's a lot of work. And you're my lazy. My sister actually told me. Your sister. You know, you can just stuff them with meat and cheese. You don't have to even batter them. You can just bake them in the Oh, oven. you're finally and listening to like our sister. That's a welcome change. And I've done that. They're really good. Oh, God. You just uh, put them in the oven and uh, roast them a minute on the, like a broil and get the skin to blister. Is this a cooking show or a mukbang? I'm really confused right and now. Then you got to cut them open and get the seeds out and then stuff them with meat and cheese. And you don't really have to batter them. Uh, you can just bake them. Okay. And they're good. We don't but care. Well, Nobody cares. That, if, you, if you really want the crunch, you could 
Just we put don't. Some, um, panko. Panko. Oh, that too. Put some panko. On. Are these Japanese chili uh, vinos? Like dip them in egg and put a little panko. Ew. And then make them like that. It'll give them crunchy without having to go through all this shit. This egg batter crap takes a long time. That's that's a lot of work. But and you're lazy. Back frozen. Of course. And it's good. It won't be. Go through a lot of shit. Okay. So Potty mouth. I'm gonna mix the. Uh, I like sour cream, so I'm gonna mix sour cream. I bet those. you do, Hooker. I hope everybody had a good week this Friday. I was until I started watching I this video. Worked to death at my company. Oh, poor baby. You have to work for we a still living. Still are short drivers. Truck oh. drivers are hard to find these days because a lot of. No, they're not. Go to the rest area, girl. And. Uh, you know, my company, we have to unload the truck Aww. and uh, put the pallet jack. And we really don't care. Do you care? The same or more than what we're paying. Well, why are you working there then? You know, it's just the freight. Wow. So, I don't know. Good luck with that shit. But, Potty know, mouth. As far as just me and one other driver trying to deliver to 500 customers. We'll get to work. But I had 16 deliveries, 16 stops today, and I'm proud of myself. <sighs> I got done by... You want a trophy? Was about 4.30, I was done. Ooh, Superman. Yeah, I went on back oh. to the warehouse, and uh, they wanted me to go to the plant and pick some more shit up, and I'm like, hey, hey, hey. that ain't happening. So, sure. All right, let's get into this. It's a Goya brand. This we know it's Goya. Good. You've said that like 17 Jeez, times. Cheese, poblano pepper. Oh, God. I say, as I cut it, I can hear it. I didn't think you could hear anything anymore. Kind of crunchy, so let's see. I had a big bite. Mmm. Oh, that's awesome, Philippines. Oh, I just realized. What? I didn't bring any napkins to the truck. Because you're a dumbass. I got napkins. No, I don't have no napkins in the glove box. Oh, yeah. poor baby. Oh, well. Mmm. I keep trying to pick a frozen dinner. That's uh -huh. gonna suck. They so all I can suck. Hell about it, but everything I've tried lately is so damn good. Well, you would think that. Very crispy, very light, very, very delicious. Oh God, I'm sure. I'm trying it. Not as good as these Filipino snacks, girl. Get me and the whole thing in here. Did you just adjust oh, the camera God, right back to where it was already? Ugh. God. Very, very good. Very, very, very good. Well, why don't you and the chili get a room already? Jesus. Mm. I cooked them in the oven. We don't care. You can, you can cook it in the microwave. Really? It says on the box, don't be a dumbass. Cook well, the oven. that's because they knew you were probably going to buy so it. I used my little Emerald Lagasse thingy. We don't care how you cooked it. It's totally irrelevant. Yeah. Actually, I'm, I'm shocked again. Really? These are really good. And the cheese, I was thinking like it was going to be like a yellow cheese. It's like a white. Why would you put yellow cheese in a chili relleno? Uh, like a white. Oh, my God. I don't know what they call that, but. Queso, maybe? Uh, Idiot. Mm, these are good. These are good. Well, you, you've already said that multiple times. God, Goya. You blowing my mind here, Goya. Are you trying to get a job at Goya? Pretty much everything I bought from Goya is pretty good, but I, I have to say I really expected this wouldn't be that great. Well, oh, so would man. I. Chilly, you know, these are freaking awesome, man. Freaking awesome, man. Very good. Oh my god. 260 calories per pepper. Let's see here. 260 calories per pepper. There's two peppers in a box. Oh my god, please. And you get 21 grams of fat. Oh and my god, please tell me you're not reading the nutritional fats, information fats, on a frozen Mexican food dinner. Cholesterol 10. Oh my god, he is. Okay, people don't eat Mexican food for their health and especially frozen Mexican food. Carbs, 11 grams. Okay, 
say it's pretty good too. How do you know you're not a dietitian? Frozen, uh, frozen thing. Oh, what a dumbass. Yeah. These are good. Let's see what it's, the ingredients stuff. It might be. Pepper ingredients. Roasted poblano pepper, cheese, milk, calcium, chloride. Yeah, we... We know what a chili piano is. We can Google it. We don't need you to tell us. This is painful to watch. I know. Just bear with me. Vegetable oil contains one or more of the following canola oil or palm oil. And that's it. Contains egg, milk, soy, wheat. Sauce ingredients. Tomato, onion, iodized salt, and garlic. So it's really... They don't have a whole lot of... Really, you just read two paragraphs of ingredients, and then he says it doesn't have a lot of stuff in it. In Mexico. He's probably drunk. Product in Mexico. But it's distributed by Goya Foods in Jersey City, New Jersey. And? So these peppers have to make a long-ass freaking journey across the United States over to New Jersey just to get back here to Texas. Oh, my God, you're a truck driver. You don't understand don't logistics. No, they don't uh, ship them from Mexico to New Jersey and then back to Texas to your man. stupid little refrigerator, idiot. They are. Oh, my God. Extremely good. Unlike this video, it's extremely bad. Blown away. I've, I've been, you know, you think most frozen foods is going to suck. You know? No, we know most frozen food sucks. Good, I hope they kill you. Oh, Jesus. It tastes just as good as any chili we know I've ever had in any restaurant. Well, that explains everything. And they're not too cheap high ass. calories, they're only 260. You wouldn't know a good it's Mexican restaurant if it hits you right in the ass. Because oh, I'm going to cook some chicken wings and buffalo wings later. You're going to eat yeah. more after this, badass? I'm hungry, but I didn't want to overdo it. Like I'm like, oh, I'm certainly I'm not. I'm bang on something that's real high in calories. You overdo every meal. That's why you're fat. Then I don't need to be Look at your, your necklace. It barely fits cheese. around your neck. But I said, well, let me, let me eat. So I dug through the freezer, and I decided on this. Yeah. So, and they are, man, I'm telling you what. If you, if you. I doubt it. And they're better than any restaurant, really. That explains everything. Damn. You don't get out much, do you, honey? Flavor's unbelievable. Oh, God. Just so good. And the the crust is light and crispy. Mm. Mm. Alcoholic. I'm sure that's got whiskey in it. Seven died at Dr. Pepper. I'm telling y'all. That's my alcoholic yeah, brother. Yeah. You will be pleasantly surprised. I doubt it. That's gross. A diet drink and oh bourbon. God. How That's gross. Delivering in the rain. Oh, Everywhere poor baby. Oh, poor baby. You don't yeah. have a raincoat, you cheap ass. And I have to unload the truck. You already Usually told us. this pallet jack. We deliver fertilizer, so. We don't care what you I'll deliver. Put it at the back of the trailer, and the uh-huh. forklift grabs it. It's rambling. And takes it off the trailer. But some of the stops I go to, they don't have a forklift. Oh, poor baby. So you gotta. I have a lift gate. But their lift gate. That's a workout. Well, you Roll need a workout, out. fat ass. Get their shit on the ground. And then they're always potty busy. mouth. Can you put it out of here. I don't really want. Oh my it. god. Ice cream lady. That lady right there. That Mexican lady. Okay. I've been living in this house for six You didn't need to bring up the fact she's Mexican. She you could have just said the ice cream lady, racist. Missed a day. That's called work yeah. ethic. She owns her own business. You should under, You should learn that, truck driver. Every night. I don't yes. give a damn if it's... One time we had a hurricane on the way. Really? The hurricane was going to hit that night. Uh-huh. Harvey. Yeah. She was out here selling fucking ice cream. Well, she's got bills to pay. Like, she pays her hey, bills. Girl, you dedicated. Her credit score's probably not a yeah, 12 like she yours. She's reliable. Okay. Which is more than I can say for some truck drivers. Yeah, starting with you. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Boy, I love the ice cream. She yeah. got to sell these on the truck. Really? Man, if we could have like a... an ice cream truck with a... like a poblano pepper. 
pepper truck. A poblano pepper truck. truck. Just combined, just, they're called. They're called. They have them. They're called oh. food trucks. They're called Mexican okay. food I, trucks. Okay. I can't handle this. I can't. I can't, I can't take it anymore. I can't take it anymore. Okay, let's just stop right there. Okay, first of all, Woody, you're mukbanging frozen food, which is ghetto. Uh, you're a big potty mouth, and um, you're drinking alcohol, and you're a borderline racist on this video. I can see why it sucks, and nobody's viewing it, okay? So now we know, okay? No need to view it any longer. Love you guys. If you want me to do another review on one of his videos, just let me know in the comments. Bye-bye.